It's shocking when I look at the old footage. That was four months ago. I have been using Grand Cosmetics on my eyebrows, on my lashes, and on my scalp, and these are my results. Maybe we'll have like a cute little montage with the beat. These are my results. Look at these eyebrows. Look at these eyelashes. <laughs> Look at this hairline. I started seeing results within two weeks of using them. And I started to get compliments on my eyelashes after two weeks. When I put mascara on, it's shocking. You know what? We should put some mascara on right now. Get right in your face. So thick, so long, and so healthy. And my eyelashes are so long that they actually get tangled with the other hairs. So I have to use a spoolie to separate them sometimes. Such a great problem to have. <laughs> In the first month, my eyebrows became so bold that I actually started to forget to use my brow pomades. There isn't a huge difference now when my eyebrows are bare compared to when I have brow pomade in them. My eyebrows haven't been this thick since I was a child. I have been growing out my eyebrows since 2000 and forever. <laughs> my eyebrow hairs are so long because they don't fall out that I actually have to trim them, otherwise they get out of hand, which is a great problem to have. For my hair, I actually started to notice that I was losing less and less hair in the shower. I just washed my hair today and the hairball was so small. When I grab it, it feels very substantial. This is a lot of hair for me. The volume, it's so much easier to get volume when you have hairs on your head. <laughs> the main area that I wanted to address for my scalp were my temples. My temples have always been sparse, so I thought like maybe I can get a little bit more of a fuller hairline. You know, when you have a ponytail, maybe a slicked one, just want it to be a little bit more sharp. I used to lose baby hairs all the time. If I just touched my baby hairs, I would lose one. And I rarely lose any baby hairs. I get to keep all of them. My hair is noticeably thicker in feel and in look than it was a few months ago. With most of the serums, you'll get your full results within four months. So this is the full results for my hair, my eyebrows, and my lashes. My eyelashes and my eyebrow hairs are so much darker now. It's shocking when I look at the old footage. That was four months ago. The main benefit of these serums is that it reduced shedding. And if you reduce shedding, the hairs that you keep can actually get longer. More hair, more thickness, more boldness. I'm gonna answer some questions that I think that you might have. What happens when you stop using the serums? Your hairs will go back to normal. They're not all gonna fall out at once, but they will eventually go back to normal. I feel like the one that is the best value is the Lash Growth Serum. I'm almost on month five, actually, and I still haven't finished my Lash Growth Serum. How often do you use them? Within the first four months for the Scalp Serum and the Brow Serum, you're gonna use it once a day, every day. For the Lash Growth Serum, you're gonna use it once a day every day for three months. For the first two months, I use the scalp serum, the brow serum, and the lash serum at night. Then I switch to a daytime use, but I'll talk more about why I did that in a little bit. How do you use them? For my eyebrows, I apply it everywhere, but I focus on the areas that really need help. So what I've been doing is I've been plucking my eyebrows where I don't want hair growth, and I've been filling them in with the brow serum where I want to see growth. I didn't have to let everything get super furry. I could just get the shape that I wanted and just slowly get more layers and rows of hairs. For my scalp, I focused on my temples because that's the area that I really wanted to see a lot of fullness and I just put like a little bit everywhere just to keep it even. For my eyelashes, I use the bare minimum amount, the thinnest little line. When you first dip it in and dip it out, there's a lot of product on there. You don't need all of that, so I like to wipe most of it off so that it's slightly, slightly damp, 
and then I like to apply it. You get a safe product that way, and you get to avoid something that we're gonna talk about <laughs> soon. You don't wanna get the product in your eyes. You don't wanna get it on your skin where you don't wanna grow hair. This stuff makes your hair darker over time, so if it gets on skin, it's gonna do that to your skin. <laughs> so only get it where you want it. When you're approaching the end of your tube, I find it really helpful to just kind of like shake the tube around a little bit just to make sure that you're getting everything. Uh, I noticed that when I was approaching the end of my brow serum, it was starting to get kind of dry. And if it's dry, it's not really getting serum where you need it. And when you can no longer get it saturated, it is time to open a new box. Did I notice any discoloration with these serums? So a common side effect of using lash growth serums is that you can get some darkening of the skin. So we know that it makes your hairs bolder, but also can make your skin darker. So I noticed in the first couple of months that I was actually getting a purple line on my eyelid. And I realized I'm like, I'm using too much serum. So I definitely make sure to scoop off the excess before I apply it to my lash line. You really don't need very much. I was able to minimize the purple line. I think I still have it a little bit, but it's not very noticeable. It almost kind of looks like makeup. I don't mind it. Can you see the purple line? This is where I'll get into why I switched from nighttime use to daytime use. It was because of discoloration and getting hair growth where I did not want it. I noticed that apparently I cry in my sleep and my tears were carrying some of the product that was on my lashes down here and I was actually starting to get hair growth under my eyes, like right here. It was pretty funny. Luckily, that's gone away now. <laughs> but if you also cry in your sleep or cry during the day a lot, then that's definitely something to think about. <laughs> I didn't even know that you could grow hair there, but you can. So for me, I know I cry at night. I don't really cry during the day. So that's when I like to use the Lash Grow Serum. Everything is reversible. Just like you stop using the products, your hair will go back to normal. If you get it in a place you don't want it, it will eventually go back to normal. What happens if you forget to use it or aren't consistent? you're gonna get inconsistent results. You're not gonna get your maximum potential. To get your full potential with these products, you gotta use them every day for those first three to four months. You guys know me. I am, I'm thorough. If I'm gonna do something, I'm gonna do it. So if you are a forgetful person, this might not be for you because you're not really gonna get your money's worth. You're not gonna really get the results that you're looking for if you can't be consistent. How do you know when to buy more product? Now, this is a tricky one because I've realized that the some products finish faster than others. The scalp serum finishes the fastest, and then the brow serum, then the lash serum. So I always have a bottle waiting to go. I don't like to wait until it's finished because Things like these, if you stop using them, you lose your results. So you always wanna make sure that you have a backup in case it finishes suddenly, in case like, I don't know, you drop it in the toilet. <laughs> if you think you're gonna forget, because we have a lot of things to remember. You have to buy the serums, you have to remember to buy toilet paper. I know I forget to buy diapers until they're almost done like all the time. So put it in your phone and get a little reminder, say, hey, buy your lash growth serum today so you don't forget. Have you guys ever tried lash growth serums, brow growth serums, scalp thickening serums? What have you had results with? Have you ever tried Grand Cosmetics? Let us know. Is there a cheaper alternative? <laughs> Let us know in the comments below. I love you guys so much. Thank you for watching and I will see you in the next video.